I'm Manica. I'm Hannah. And together we make the Hannica Show. So, you guys may or may not know this, but I am a vegetarian. I have not eaten meat in, I think this month it'll be a year. We've decided to make a how to be a vegetarian video to help all of you animal carcass eaters relate to me. Prepared. Yes. I like chicken. Psst, I don't. Uh, we're gonna go make some veggie food. Well, we're gonna microwave it and tell you guys about it. And we're gonna eat it. And for the record, it does taste like the real thing. Man, that stuff is good. It Let me really just tell is. You right now. It's so we got veggie chicken nuggets. These are like one of my favorites. Um, veggie burgers. They're also very good. This may you may or may not have heard of. Veggie riblets. They're essentially just like pork ribs that aren't actually pork. <laughs> and then we got chicken patties. It's like a chicken sandwich. It's basically these in sandwich form. I'm gonna make two veggie nuggets. And there's also veggie hot dog, like veggie dogs. I just have never been a big hot dog person. I do, veggie dogs aren't bad, but I don't get them often just because, like I said, I'm not a hot dog person. So these, we just stick them in the microwave. It's a very low maintenance cooking process. These are a little bit different, but it's worth it because they taste like dreams. Not really, they taste like ribs. This is what a typical veggie riblet looks like. It's just like squares of non-meat with barbecue sauce in one end because I think it was just tilted to the wrong end. So I stick this in the microwave for two and a half minutes. This is a, this will be in there for like a minute and 15 seconds because I don't want to over burn. Just... I like fruit too. I like pineapples. It's done. The microwave. Voila. Delicious. Time to stick this in there. Two and a half minutes. Yeah. Just because I'm a vegetarian doesn't mean I just eat vegetables. I like fruit. I like carbs. So, our riblet is done. Bon appetit. I love barbecue sauce. Look at that, your veggie food. Now that you've seen our process of making and conversations while making the veggie food, here's our finished product for the chicken slash beef interpretations. And this deliciousness, which is my riblet. I get to eat half of this. Fine. See, this is now veggie food from the perspective of a vegetarian and a Omnivore. And omnivore. Sorry. And omnivore. <laughs> so I'm gonna start with my riblet because they're really good. Very good. It tastes just like actual pork. But I guess it's healthier. Yeah. No cholesterol. Perfect. No cholesterol. I don't have to worry about having a heart attack, at least for reasons of high cholesterol. But Even for people who aren't vegetarians, I would still recommend this stuff. It's really, really good. It's so good. Moving on to the hamburger. Well, hamburger. Not quite as good as the riblets, but I don't like beef. Me so neither. that could be a lot of it. But still, really good. Better than a hamburger. Mm -hmm. It's weird eating dinner on camera. I know. Moving on to the chicken patty chicken patty. Yes, it's spelled on the box. It's C H I K apostrophe N. Tastes like chicken. Huh. Nope. Tastes like chicken. And just My like personal else. favorite are the and chicken nuggets. nuggets. They're just so good. I'd ask for these over regular chicken nuggets. All day. Okay guys, this is random, but like this video if you like pugs, because I do. And now, Annika's going to tell us how to be a vegetarian. 
Well, since that's kind of the name of this. Right. We're giving you samples of food to eat. There's pretty much veggie meat everywhere. Yeah. So, since you don't eat meat, what do you eat in place to get your protein? Well, a lot of this veggie food has the amount of protein that the real thing does. So that's where I get a lot of my protein. And I don't really eat beans. I do occasionally, but not often. And I'm allergic to nuts, so that rules out nuts, which have lots of protein. So I eat tofu, which is soybean curd, which is edamame. It's just soybean. It's really good. And the veggie food is actually made of soy, which is from soybeans, edamame. Have it at Japanese restaurants. It's real good. Sheets, leaves, and grass. Yeah. Nope. No. <laughs> like a lot of people think that like stereotypical vegetarians like, oh, you eat salads all day long. I don't. I'm also I'm not a huge fan of salads. Yeah. She's one of the vegetarians I know that does not like salads. Like I like salads more than she does. Yeah, you really do. I'll eat them occasionally, but I'm just not a big salad person. I do drink soy milk occasionally. I I don't really like milk. I'm not a vegan. A vegetarian doesn't eat meat. A vegan doesn't eat animal products. So I eat eggs. I only eat egg whites though. I just don't like the way the yolk tastes. It's not because I'm a vegetarian or not. But I eat regular cheese when I do eat it. Whatever. Variations. Pescatarians. They, it's basically a vegetarian that eats fish. I eat fish on very few occasions. I consider myself a vegetarian, but like when we go to the lake, there's a really good restaurant down the lake that has catfish that tastes like dreams. So I eat catfish occasionally. That's honestly about it. But pescatarians eat fish. Vegetarians don't eat meat. Vegans don't eat any animal byproducts at all. And a term invented my, by my friend, Emma, is a polyutarian, which means basically she just eats chicken. I guess that concludes our show Ooh. for the day. Hope you guys learned something. And if you have any questions, feel free to comment. Anna will answer. Well, you've learned how to be a vegetarian. You've learned some different foods you can try. You've learned the differences in vegetarian, pescatarian, vegetarian, and polyutarian. Yes. You know, Spanish word for chicken is pollo. Yes, that's where that originated <laughs> from. Stay tuned for tomorrow. Don't forget about our Thursday covers. I'm sure you haven't. We've already done a ton of them. But in case you have and you only come out from under your little rock on Wednesdays, <laughs> You should also come out of your rock on Thursdays and watch our covers. Stay tuned for our next videos on um, next Wednesday and Thursday. Hope to see y'all back. Whoop, whoop. And now we're going to like...